ball stack circuits do they work and I'm trying out this little um, um, little oscillator you can see here um, and I got a full stat, you know, it's in transistors, um, let's see, oscillators, yeah, and, uh, yeah, it's a cold plus oscillator right here, so, but I made a couple modifications to it just to get more realistic values, uh, you know, adjusted the inductance down to 4.7, Milli Henry and then a couple of one microfarad um, poly caps and uh, I guess a 2N2222 transistor but otherwise I kept the resistor values pretty much the same. Um, So, you know, basically these are the cap capacitors and <laughs> loose connection on the breadboard here, but then the you know, little inductor is there. And uh, there's the transistor and uh, resistors, you see. And I got hooked a little piezo element, which, you know, that's pretty good, um, you know, with all things considered. Um, and, um, you know, and there's pretty much the output, you know, on the oscilloscope. Now, I noticed, too, you know, I'm running three volts, um, you know, reduce it to two volts, you know, it's about 3.5 kilohertz and go up to five volts like they recommend. It's about 3.8 kilohertz versus what they, um, you know, they predict here, um, Yeah, you can see it at the uh, you know 3.1 kilohertz for these values. So, but at any rate, yeah, know, it's a uh, you know pretty simple little oscillator. And uh, you know as you up the voltage further, you know the tone does increase in frequency, as you can note out here, uh, but not by that much surprisingly. So it's you know surprisingly you know approximately you know 3.6 kilohertz you know, give or take a little bit, you know, based on the voltage, and it goes down to even 2 volts. I don't think I can go down to 1 volt. Nope. <laughs> but, um, anyway, uh, it's a pretty neat little circuit, so yeah, I'd have to say, yes, this circuit actually does work. So, you know, um, that's, uh, that's nifty. So, that, that's uh, actually potentially useful, a little single channel oscillator. Again, it's not a great not a sine wave, but I mean, you know, it's not a square wave either, so it's somewhere in between. So, anyways, um, cheers.